Well, breakthrough local research is helping to solve the mystery of what causes sudden infant death syndrome. In a world first, Adelaide researchers believe a lack of oxygen could be responsible for the unexplained deaths of babies across the globe. Bradley Womb was a healthy, happy baby, but one night, without warning, the nine-week-old's life was cut short. My husband gave him what was to be his last bottle, um, put him down to bed, and I walked in the next morning and found him and no longer with us. 28 years later, Jill still doesn't know the exact cause of Bradley's sudden infant death syndrome, but a local scientific breakthrough could provide the answer. University of Adelaide researchers compared protein patterns in the brain and discovered a striking similarity between babies who died from SIDS and those who died from accidental suffocation. When we cracked the code, the pattern for the SIDS babies was virtually identical to the pattern for the babies who had suffocated. Not like infection at all, not like head trauma. In one case, the signs on the brain of a baby boy that died from SIDS may have helped save his brother, who had some of the telltale marks. When this boy was investigated in the hospital, he was discovered not to be controlling his breathing properly. For affected families, this research is a step closer to solving the mystery of SIDS and stopping other babies from suffering the same fate. What's come forward, I think, is just so significant and really makes sense. I think that every bit of knowledge um, that, that we glean helps us save lives into the future. Jessica Stanley, Nine News.